You read that right. We're asking what if humans never existed. It would be much more boring to tell the truth without us, but the environment and wildlife would be much healthier and more diverse. Basically, humans have driven a bunch of animals to extinction in the past, especially megafauna that were vulnerable to overhunting. Today, most of us can only think of African megafauna such as elephants, rhinos, and hippos. But the only reason for that is because human activities haven't gotten them yet. These animals are in the danger zone today, and will likely disappear if current trends continue, but so far they are one of the only megafauna on the planet. What we are seeing today is a watered-down version of the past. Just a few thousand years ago, the Americas were home to huge wolves, woolly mammoths, lions, ground sloths, and a whole bunch of awesome stuff we'll likely never get to see. Sure, we have moose, bison, and musk oxen, but what's really exotic about that? Imagine lions prowling in a grassy field where Manhattan is today, woolly mammoths migrating over North Canada, and salivating packs of dire wolves ripping small furry animals to shreds. I don't know why I just said that. Anyway, everywhere you would look, you could only see an unspoiled wilderness. Mile after mile of pristine wilds. The temperature will be cooler due to global warming not happening at all. And the environment will be better off. All of those animals we killed off over the course of millennia may still be thriving, although changing climates may still drive some to extinction. It would be one good thing for another, basically. You would have this pristine wilderness with the abundance of life that we see on the Serengeti all throughout the world, but you also wouldn't have the culture, the technology, the history that comes with humanity. There wouldn't be any species out there that can ponder the questions and mysteries of the cosmos and try to figure them out. If you ask me, that seems a bit too much for an extra ground slot or two. No offense, environmentalists. And thanks for watching.